What's up everybody? My name is Scott Paddock and it's time for another two minute tutorial. In my last video about articulations, I mentioned the Gerald Albright front F and I got tons and tons and tons of requests to show you guys how to do it. So here is the tutorial on the Gerald Albright front F. If you're watching this video, I'm assuming that you are a fan of Gerald Albright. If so, leave me a comment below with your favorite Gerald Albright album or song. Mine is Live at Birdland West, Georgia on my mind. If you're new to my channel, please make sure that you subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and click the bell for notifications. If you're not sure what the Gerald Albright front F sounds like, it sounds like this. The first time I heard Gerald Albright play that front F sounding like that was on his Live at Birdland West album on the tune Georgia On My Mind. If you never heard his arrangement or him playing that tune, you should absolutely check it out. It is amazing. It's one of my favorite saxophone solos and songs of all time. So let's learn how to play it in under two minutes starting right now. I call this the Gerald Albright front F because Gerald Albright played it and it is a front F. If you don't know how to finger a front F, it is with your C key and the front F key, which is this teardrop looking key above your B key. So it's your C key with your front F key. Now, if you play that front F, that won't give you the Gerald Albright sound. We need to add a couple things to it. The first thing is everything on your right hand. So one, two, three, plus your E flat key. One, two, three, plus your E flat key. So it will look like this. Adding the right hand gets us a whole lot closer, but we still need to do a couple more things to make it sound the way Gerald Albright sounds. First, you wanna play it short and squatty like a marcato or what I would call a dop. And you wanna scoop down on each of the notes. When you scoop down, it gives you a doua, doua, doua. So just think about the word doua and do that with your tongue and you're gonna get that sound. The lower you get your tongue, the better it's gonna sound. Now this isn't a pretty sounding articulation. It's gonna sound really in your face and raspy. And if it sounds like that, you're doing it right. So you're gonna to wanna to use this at the high end, the climax of one of your solos. That's where it's gonna sound really good. You don't wanna just throw it in there anyway. You have to build in to this front F sound. And that's how you play the Gerald Albright front F. If you'd like to learn a lot more about style and articulation and improv and just the saxophone in general, I'd like to invite you into my saxophone world at the Scott Paddock Sax School, where I will teach you step by step how to become a better saxophone player. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.